Hi, my name is Katie Repka and I am a DMA clarinet performance major at George Mason University. Today I'm going to talk to you about air support when playing the clarinet. Now this is a really, really important topic because that's how you create a really solid, structured sound. You know, if we, if we don't have good air support, the sound's gonna be spready, it's not gonna sound very good, we're gonna play out of tune. Um, there's a lot of things that, that we rely on when we play the instrument, and one of them is, is the air support. So, to begin, we should know that clarinet is a cold air instrument. And what I mean by this is the air we produce is very fast, which is that cold air. So a lot of our brass friends, they use a warm air, which is like fogging a mirror. Whereas clarinet, we're fast, cold air. And so how we accomplish that is how we breathe. So when we're breathing in, we wanna think about filling our whole body. So the air is expanding into our back, into our lungs, into our chest, into our lower belly. And it's almost like you're filling an inner tube up. And now when we exhale, we want to think about pushing the air like an aerosol can. So everything stays, stays outwardly contracted and it's a fast push with the air. And you wanna really engage your core when you do this. So I like to put my hands on my stomach and I'll inhale. And when I exhale, I like to keep my belly extended. So that helps maintain that fast air. And I'll show you what I mean by that. So if we have not a great air support on the clarinet, we're gonna get this kind of sound. Kind of shaky it's not very centered and it's out of tune but if we use this air support we talked about you can hear how supported the sound is and one thing we should also make note of is when we're pushing the air through the instrument we want to think about filling like a straw through the center of it so almost i like to refer to like a coffee stir straw so it's really really thin air stream we're not trying to fill the whole clarinet with our sound if we try to fill the whole clarinet with this, the same fast air, we get this. Kind of spready still. But if we focus it like this coffee stir straw or just, you know, just any small straw that you can think of, it'll sound like this. And we want to use this air all the time. So whether we're playing loud, whether we're playing soft, we're always going to use this fast, fast air is just how much air we're putting through the instrument. So I'll show you loud, I'll show you soft um, in just a second, and that'll kind of be an example of how I'm gonna use this fast air, but still maintain these dynamics. So here's a loud or forte dynamic. And then here is gonna be a soft or piano dynamic. So I'm still using that fast, cold air, but I'm just using less of it when I put it through the instrument. So some tools that you can do, you can practice your breathing. You can have the, your hand in front of you and practice like you're blowing out a candle and you want it to be like super precise. And you wanna see how long you can keep that going. And again, you can put your hands on your belly and practice that way. I like to practice a couple inhales, exhales, and do that a couple times before putting it through my clarinet. So hopefully that helps you a little overview on breathing on the clarinet, and I will get back to you soon with some more tools.